What's up, Zox fam? Now, Kiro Games has been cooking up some stuff, and a prime example of this is obviously the new Jian Shin showcase that just came out. But as I was watching this, this kind of got me thinking, and I feel like Kiro told us already what we could be potentially be seeing. Now, give me a chance to explain, okay? Because I know you guys are probably like, Zox, what are you talking about? They didn't tell us this already. But just hear me out, okay? So the main thing is, and if you guys recall up on the channel, I did a reaction video actually getting into uh, some of the things that were going on on the CN side. Now, we obviously didn't get this on EN, so obviously there's no real way for us to have known that this was a thing. Now, there was a video that was actually going through some advertisements, and it kind of got me to thinking about what exactly was depicted in this specific video. Now, if we actually pause for a second, and we go back to the very beginning of the video, you'll see here that what is being emphasized or what's being shown is Jian Shan working at the tea house, right? So the main, like, and one of the first scenes here you see is her obviously balancing these tea uh, cups, right? And she's at, obviously, the tea house. Now, I want you guys to pay very, very close attention to something. If you guys zoom in all the way, and I'll zoom in, okay? <laughs> if you zoom in all the way here to the back corner, remember that this was one of the drinks that was shown in the advertisement. So this is confirming that these advertisements were 100% for this, but I even want to take it a step further, right? So the other thing that also is being confirmed here is that the tea house is a, represent a representation or a tie-in specifically to Jian Shin. Now, let me explain that part as well. So where my brain was going, and I'm going to play this real quick so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Now, remember the water that we just zoomed in and looked at. This is actually that box, right? So this is that container, and this is obviously an item that they sell at the tea house. Not sure if that's where it is originated from, but that's obviously where you can get it, right? Now, the next thing that's going to be shown here, and again, this is also emphasizing, this is from the Huashu academy so that's a whole nother place right that's not the tea house and i want to make that very very clear here okay so then the next thing here is the tea the tea okay okay I, okay i'm gonna break this down right i'll let this play so you see wow cool tea is being cooked <laughs> we got tea got hot tea right and then this is the louis sean tea house right so then this kind of got me to thinking. So if the tea house is connected to Jian Xin, then that means that some of the other advertisements that we've seen could be very well connected to other characters. And the reason why I make a point to say, of saying that is because even when you look here at the black cat scenario, this cat is a representation of the rover. And when they have the zoom out scene, where it actually shows the rover themselves looking at these advertisements, it kind of is like almost a weird thing to kind of emphasize like, hey, this is like that correlation or relevance. Now, some people might be like, how do you know that the cat is a representation of the rover? Well, if we take a closer look here, this is actually, and I can't remember what this is called, but it's basically what you use, if I'm not mistaken, to capture echoes. Um, that is the same one, if I'm not mistaken, that the rover actually wears, and they actually have it around the black cat's neck. And that's a really, really important thing to be emphasizing because none of the other cats have that being emphasized. And then even when you're just kind of looking at the color scheme and like the layout of the cat, it's very similar to the rover, right? If we're if we're just being honest here, okay? So when I'm kind of looking at these different context clues, and even like I mentioned before, you see the shopping cart in the back corner, I'm almost speculating here, okay? And this is the point that I wanted to make. I'm speculating that each of these commercials are tied to a different character. And the reason why I feel like that could be is because I think even with a Chesia or Chesaya, if I'm not mistaken, she actually does something delivery wise. I can't remember if it was like uh, what it was specifically in the CBT one, because it's been a little bit since I actually have read the story for that. But I do remember her actually being someone that delivered something or a messenger of some sort. Like she did something. And so I think that that's going to actually tie into what they were actually foreshadowing with this advertisement. And at first I thought it was just because of the fact that it was Chinese Lunar New Year. So they were just trying to do something like super witty. 
But I really honestly think Kuro is honestly thinking even more broader and they're a lot more witty than I even thought from that initial video. Because like I said, prime example, we got shown the tea house and then the very next thing they show us was the showcase for Jian Shin. So I don't know guys, I feel like they're going to be doing this throughout the process and we have to really actually start paying a lot more attention to the things that they're showing that might not seem as significant because it seems like it's going to be leading into much bigger pictures now i could be going for a complete stretch here but i do pay very close attention to minute details like that because i actually do like these things so again let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below because I think that what Kiro is cooking up here is much bigger than what we even have thought it was going to be. And like I said, even being able to find some of these correlations in the, like I said, the visuals, and then being able to tie it back in, into previous videos is a really, really good job in my opinion. So I'm extremely excited. Let me know how you guys and what you guys think. What do you guys think on this advertisement? I'm gonna leave this link down below so you guys can check it out. Who do you think these advertisements are linked to? I mean, like I know that there's obviously, like we know now the tea house is linked to uh, Jian Shin, but who do you guys think the other food restaurants are linked to? So let me know in the comment section down below, but that's gonna be that guys. Everyone stay blessed and I'll catch you guys in the next one.